Hello and welcome back to details about aerial view part 2. Uh, in this episode I'm going to try to explain all the things or most of the things that I've built in this town. And as I said in the previous episode, the idea came from this uh, laying this track. So I laid the track in here, trying to keep it on the same elevation and then I've realized the rest of the town is, is in a ditch. So I was thinking it will be nice to have a, a retaining wall. So that's, I've started here initially with this uh, retaining wall. I placed a couple of uh, rocks and then I placed the airport. And um, I, I liked the idea how it looked. And I just continued, obviously I've not used stone in here, I've used uh, the retaining wall. And then from then, from there, I just kept expanding and then uh, I've realized I should drop it one more level. So, so it'll be like a, like some stairs. Obviously it was, uh, it was easier said than done. So I'm going to start from from here and I'm going to try and explain roughly what I've done. So first thing is first, this is a handmade uh, monument if you want and I'm going to try and show you uh, wh where exactly you can find the things to do it. So. In the track assets, you get, I'm not sure, this is a whole set of mods. Uh, you can find it on workshop. And then you get like a, like a pillar. And you get longer ones as well. And then you can change the texture. With whatever you want. And then you can change the size as well. And is it this one? Yes, you can. Uh, I'm trying to find the word here. You can do it like this. So I place one of them, and then obviously two small ones. And you get some some plane assets and I've just raised it up and placed place the plane in there. Uh, it should have been the other, the other way around facing facing the sky but it's it's done now so we'll have to do. Next thing is this retaining wall. If you ask me how I done it you can basically place tracks on the water and then if you have the mod you can you can place this bridge invisible bridge just like that apologies for the frame rate this town uh, is the worst worst part of the map where uh, uh, the, the frame rate drops quite uh, dramatically it might be the war, I don't know. Right, so again, same mod, bridge and dam construction. Same mod, you place whatever you want. For example, this one, because that's what I've done in there. Actually, it's, it's a different style, but it doesn't matter. Right, so I placed exactly the same thing. I'm going to try to find uh, the same material that I've used in there. Just so I can show you how I've done it. So I've used the, the hollow archways. And then I think I've used one of them. And I've changed... 
the appearance and you can you can change the distance from the uh, from, from the track center right so if I place that one in there then place that one you can basically put inside whatever you want I know there's uh, there's already filled ones but sometimes I don't like the appearance so you can make your own All right that's let's let's finish this the whole whole sector Right, so I'll place those and then you can place something else I'll, I'll try to find them I think they're in here somewhere exactly the same same color you can change it again so let's say I'll put that one in there this one in here this one And all the way to the end and then I'm for that this one yes uh, it's this one but uh, thinner so you can change the wet on them now that one uh, this one And change the appearance. I think it's uh, wood. Yeah. So more or less, this is how I've done it. All the way, all the way around. Uh, and you can place those uh, lamp lamp posts. I'm sure it's an asset from somewhere. This small restaurant, you can find it in here. Somewhere. There is, and then keeper's house, and again you can you can change it to um, whatever color you want. And I placed four of them. Some flowers. Well, try to try to make it as they look like flowers. They're just uh, bushes different color of bushes and then this is the same same plant again same small tree and I've just tried to write the name of the town it took me a while to do this same with all the all the umbrellas uh, you get umbrellas but none like this one and This is Smek Garten. I, I don't know what more more this. So you you get this umbrella, and then you place it once, and then you press M, you flip it uh, twice basically, and then press it twice again, and there you go. This is what you can. Uh, Press one, place it, and then hold shift. Oh no! Right, try again. So, place it, then flip it around twice, three times. It's the same thing. Maybe I've just done it twice. Yeah, 
So just two umbrellas in here. You can place pretty much three, I think. And then you can change the, the appearance on them as well. You can place this one. So the thing is, if you move it away, if you move the mouse, you won't be able to get in uh, in the exact same same position. And we got a treat, and then in a small restaurant. Okay, and then I placed three docks, one big one, and then two small ones. I like this uh, ship, and then some more more rocks, and a small small pier, a lighthouse, and then this is the beach. And this is all manually placed in here, um, like a residential uh, posh area. And then we got the beach, in the distance we can see another project that I've started and uh, I'm gonna show it in a minute. Um, what else? I like I like the, the the red trees. This is like a small park. Got a cu couple of people, some people with the bikes. Tried to design, like I said again, a, a posh res res residential area. Sorry. Um, you can see they're still building. Although, I think I should be, might be too far away. So, they're the blockers to stop the AI for, from building. I'm gonna smooth this out. And you can find the blockers in here. So, they're collision object and you get the transparent one place a couple so they don't build again uh, be aware if you have trees and you place them well some of them will disappear So you have you have them and then the length and then you have uh, them as a curb as well as a curb you can change the height on them uh, small sailing boat a campfire or a, a beach fire a couple of tents and a couple of toilets and this is where I stopped with the decoration I'm gonna go along and so this was meant to be as a industrial harbor um, it's never been I stopped when I finished uh, the aerial view part 2 and I never actually done anything to it since so I will get done eventually. I'm gonna show you. I've tried to keep all the residential area around here. And then the plan was the commercial to be on this side around here. But because I had to I was running out of patience and I had to do the aerial view part 2. I plopped the buildings myself 
is to fill up the gaps. So the plan was commercial on those two levels and then industrial was already here and some more more residential. Uh, you can you can force them to grow. So for example, if you delete this, they'll build it back. Uh, but if you block it like this with a track or whatever you want, then they'll they'll move it somewhere where they have space, for example there. And that's how I moved. Industrial area was around here and some around here and I just moved it all around here. Obviously I start the building again up there. Um, so we have the I was I was in two minds what to do in here because obviously the the train station was in here and I was thinking it was nice to have um, like a separate area where the cars or the buses won't won't be able to to go so we have no cars around here just the trams uh, going on the on the road So again, the same, uh, same kind of idea here. We we'll have a look. We should have. I think it, this is road. I placed. I placed the road so close. To that, road in there, and there's no actual terrain deformation you can you can actually see the the sidewalk is quite far away you see that it looks like a ghost it's Halloween though it might be a ghost probably Halloween Halloween in the game as well so I placed a couple of bushes for for details and uh, a, a small fence around here all the way around um, and then we have the stops and some connection so the people will be able to go to the bus station and then obviously wherever they want to go uh, a statue here and more more uh, bushes for decorations the trams and then added the the fences you can find those fences in here it won't stop anything from building uh, so if if a house will be to build here they will build it on top of the fence it's not it's not a AI blocker you can find the fence in here get yeah, different this one oh. This is the one. You get different colors and I think some some different shapes as well. You change to B and then it's a different different kind of uh, of fence. And I need a, a turnaround for the for the trams to turn around and natural ways not just flip around in the middle of the road uh, and I found this uh, turnaround but uh, you can you can you can actually add uh, tram tracks on it so this is just for decoration and, uh, a tram depot in there a couple of stones then in here you get quite a lot of uh, vegetation um, what else? Uh, I place this free, free station in here and then place it up here and obviously they'll get the commercial 
mo most of the commercial part and I was like uh, I need to get the industrial as well and I came up with this idea of building this bridge over the over the road and uh, I placed a free station here a truck station sorry and then I've I've just extended uh, so this this kind of bushes they are in a, in a line they are fence and they will block the AI you can find it in here uh, in fences and then I think I think this mod's just been updated uh, it used to be wood metal pasture and that was it I think Oh wow. This is some nice fences. There are some nice fences. I like it. Yeah, the, the mod's been updated apparently. Yeah, this was here before. Metal rods was here. Wire mesh was here. Azalea. Or Azalea. Yeah, they, they were here before, and they will stop the AI for, from uh, from building. That's nice. Wow, we have some uh, some new stuff to play with. So. Uh, yeah, this is the, the truck station. Uh, whilst. And then I had to come up with an idea for the trams to connect with the main town. So I came up with this uh, bridge. And... And then I had to build a tunnel through here, which wasn't as easy. I had a lot of uh, collision, collision uh, terrain align, alignment collision, sorry, uh, with it. Then I place like a sidewalk in here so people can go around uh, if they want to. Um, and then obviously this I've just continued being as a viaduct up to up to about here and then I stopped in here. Um well so as to say um, Yeah the the road uh, initially I built this road around here. Uh, just like that. And then I'll let the, the AI decide what it wants to do. So let's say, for example, the AI placed the road in here, but it wasn't straight at all. So what I've done, I've just took the same road that I've used and delete the road that the AI put in and then add my own, own road as I want it, like straight. And then the AI will stop trying to build roads. So if you keep up, uh, putting the roads where the AI wants to then you'll have no problem uh, keeping the roads the way you want uh, what else we got, we got a farm in here we got this farm two uh, three one mills and we're shipping the, the grain down here into this station and then this train will take it all the way there and brings back some uh, food I think does it? yes it does um, I don't know what else uh, what else should I show you if I missed anything and you're interested and something just 
uh, write a comment and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. Uh, I must, I m might uh, missed something. Should we? Oh, I've, I've missed this one. Uh, this is a small park that I've, uh, I've put together. Uh, I think it, it looks uh, looks in the right place. I think. Should we should we take a, a ride on the bus to see how on the trams? Sorry, to see how it looks. Uh, where's where's the tram? There we go. Let's see. We'll, we'll have a, a little ride on Buntingford local tram line. Uh, the frame rate isn't great, but it could could be worse. Could be worse. There are a lot of people, and then this is a separate uh, piece of road that only trams can get into it. Uh, It might be a bit too narrow, I think. So we're we going up the bridge. You can see the plane taking off over there. And there's the the train in the distance. And then we have small details around, uh, a lot of plants, a fence. Uh, for some reason, my, my uh, as a catenaries for trams, my, those poles are black. Uh, I think it must have been a mod that I've activated, and for that reason, they're they're black. And in uh, a new game, they're they're grey. Uh, I've not figured it out what's uh, causing that, but it doesn't really bother me. There's a train. There's a big stain of uh, smoke and smoke and diesel, and you can see those those cliffs are nice in there. There's another plane. Uh, you can see some of the some of the surrounding areas. a lot of people walking train station and the frame rate is going down I think because we can see we can see a different town in the distance and then we have the water and there's quite a lot of, of uh, details going around I'm actually surprised that this map lasted that long. Um, I had a couple of mods that disappeared, but uh, uh, I was very fortunate because I don't, I never used them, so I, I, I was able to uh, just disable the mod and continue with the map. So far, we see the beach in there. We can see the the harbor. Stop again at the station. We'll, we'll jump off and we'll go into the next one. That goes the other way around. There's a lot of trams going around. Yeah, so this bit is quite laggy. Uh, 
think it's because you can see you can see that town in the distance and there's quite, there's quite a lot of uh, detailing the moment I'm, I'm getting 15 uh, frame, frames per second I don't know I'm playing in there. It's quite quite a busy airport. It's a small airport but very busy. I right, will we'll take this uh take, take this ride all the way to the to the tram tram uh, station bus stop bus station and then uh, we'll call it an episode. Train accelerates. I wonder if we keep up. Watch out for the tram. There's a bus down there. There's a freight train. Yeah, this this is getting provided with uh, food only at the moment. I'm gonna expand eventually. And uh, that's why the port is there. I was thinking we can uh, ship everything down there with ships and then pick it up with the train and bring it into the station on the right. That was the plan. We'll see if we get, get around to do it. Again, uh, the frame rate is dropping, and it might be the end of the month. Oh, this is the this is the wrong tram. What is it? Right, we don't want to go to the airport. We just want to go to the station. I've just missed a plane going going to the left. But we're going down here. Yeah. In the distance, there, that's where uh, aerial, uh, aerial View Part 3 uh, is, or was recorded in that area. So that's, that's the next episode. So as you go down, you can see the small park, which looks really, really good. Uh, I placed people and fountains and a lot of stuff. As you as you usually find in a in a park, I really like those red trees. I don't know uh, what kind are they, but they're really nice. Well, we're taking a left now. You can see the port there, and then we take a left. And we're back into the the bus station. Right. I hope you enjoyed this video and um, any qu any questions just drop me a comment and I'll try to to uh, respond as as quick as possible once again thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you soon with the next uh, aerial view thank you bye bye